Hi, I'm Josh, and today we're going to be talking about progressive muscle relaxation to help manage anxiety. So if you watched some of the previous videos, you already know what anxiety is, and you also know that breathing can counteract the anxious response. So I want to build on that a little bit today by teaching you something called progressive muscle relaxation. Um, what it is, is systematically flexing and relaxing muscle groups in sync with your breathing. So if you're following the mindful breathing that I was teaching you earlier, then you're going to be breathing on a system that is five seconds in, holding it for five seconds, and then breathing five seconds out. So what I want you to do is kind of envision yourself as a mountain, and we're going to climb up that mountain from the base. So that's going to represent your feet. So what you want to do is when you breathe in, you are going to flex your toes, curl them as tightly as you can, and as you hold your breath, you're going to hold that quench. And then when you breathe out, you're going to relax them. And what you want to do is notice the feeling. Notice the sensation of tension that is created when you breathe in and while you're holding it and while you're flexing. And then when you breathe out, I want you to be aware of that relaxed sensation that follows. You're going to do this for a few reps. So a rep is in, hold, out. So four reps is going to take 60 seconds. So four reps for your feet, and then you will move up to your calves, then you'll move up to your thighs, your butt, your stomach, your chest, shoulders, biceps, forearms, your hands. You can do your shoulders by shrugging them, your neck by rolling it, your jaw clenching it tightly, your eyes squinting them tightly, and even the tiny muscle group that exists inside of your forehead right? By raising your eyebrows as high as you can, flexing all those little muscles, and then bringing it back down and relaxing it. If you do this, by the time you get to the top of the mountain, you should notice yourself being in a much more relaxed state. You might even find yourself feeling somewhat groggy or tired. So this strategy is not only effective at helping reduce anxious symptoms, but it could also be an effective strategy to help you fall asleep at night if that's something that you struggle with. If you find yourself getting to the top of the mountain and you're still feeling a little anxious, you're still feeling a little stressed, don't worry. You can go back down the mountain, right? And you can do it as many times as you need to. But if done appropriately, you're not going to do it more than probably one rep up and down. So try it out. See if it helps.